back. This is A-Level Computer Science 9618 Paper 4 and our topic would be linked list with array. In the previous video we discussed about uh, put implementing OOP object oriented program in my in, in the linked list. That was only just the concept. I didn't uh, you know I just I only the reason why I did make that video is because so that just you guys could understand how linked list really works. Okay in the university they will taught you like this. You're going to implement, implement this in the in the upcoming future you know programming stuff but this one is part of your syllabus linked list with array so they're teaching you with array just to give you an, a brief idea that how linked list work even though i just make a video about oop so if you want to know the real logic of how linked list really work you can, you can check that video you know linked list with oop but linked list with array is part of your syllabus i think this is the one that you should memorize and then and, and that just give the paper okay so uh, right now linked list with array means that you have uh, two columns one column is for the data 27 19 36 data and the other other column is pointers okay so supposing this whole uh, this whole thing is a node okay and this node is pointing to this node this node is pointing to this node and until it's pointing to null minus one is null okay so it looks something like this this whole thing is a data pointer uh, so it linked of data okay and this whole thing is pointers we got two head head pointer means that it's start the it's starting from here and this one is pointing to this 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 this one is pointing to null and free head pointer starting from here free head pointers mean that we having a list which is completely free free nodes that we can take out and put into the put into the linked list okay so free nodes start from here six is Pointing, uh, uh, pointing to this, 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 pointing to null. We got the node would look, look so, something like this and each node have a data and a pointer. This point is pointing to this, you know, it's, this is how it should look like. Now, if I put 27, let me just... If I put 27, I will create a node. Okay, so initially we are putting 27, so I am going to create a node. Okay, so I got 27 and it is pointing to null. The index is 0 and initially this is the head pointer. So since now, uh, before that was the linked list was empty, but now we are inserting 27. So now this is the link, this is the head pointer. But if you add another one, 19, this index is 1. And so now this will point to 0. This will point to this one. Okay, so this will be, this will be null and this would be the head pointer. Then we add another one, let's say if I put 36, putting 36 and I got, now I'm pointing to this one, 1, 36 is pointing to this, 90 is pointing to this and then end is minus 1. So now this is pointing to this and this is the head pointer. I put another one, 42 and uh, this now will point to this one and the head pointer would be 1. And at the end I got 16, so 16, and now it's pointing to this. So the head pointer is 16 now. So you can see the similarities, okay? This is point to this, this point to this, point to this, point to this, point to now. Point to this, point to this, point to this, point to this, and now. So this is how it's working. This is how you insert and you create a link. There's minus one, zero, one, two, three, six, okay. So you can see here, this is our head pointer. This is pointing to this one, this point to this one, this point to this one, this one is pointing to this one. Head pointer is four and head free pointer is five, which means this one. Okay. Now, let's see the code. First of all, what I've just done here, I have the class linked list and I've just created two uh, columns or you can say two arrays link data and pointers head pointer would be minus one because we are currently pointing to no one there's no head pointer initially and free head pointer would be zero because it's completely empty free head pointer would be zero this one point to this okay like this uh, until the last node will be pointing to null nothing so this is the this is the state initially when we try to create a linked list without having any data now after creating this uh, so okay so i just said uh, is equals to new link list 11 11 would be the number to create the, the nodes so i've called the constructor and link data pointer it will be initialized having each one uh 11 columns 
okay i mean sorry 11 uh, 11 nodes as a whole and each node contains a data and a pointer i have just um, yeah so this is initial i'm doing initialization in here in the constructor so pointers dot length pointers i plus one which means it is after getting this node this is would be initialized to one because it is pointing to this one so and then at the end it will be null minus one this is this is complete in initialization now what if i wanted to add something so if free head pointer is equals to minus one right now he free head pointer is zero but if it become minus one which means that the whole data is filled completely and there's nothing there's no space for another element to come okay so that's that means that the no free space link list is full else if else and i just going to i'm going to take the content of the head pointer head pointer is minus one comes in here always remember that head pointers keeps on changing for example okay for example uh, right now i'm putting 27 okay so i'm putting 27 and so uh, right now head pointer is <coughs> minus one head pointer is minus one i want to put 27 so let me create this this would be 27 and the head pointer would be this one Okay, and obviously I think it would be zero. This would be zero, and this would be pointed to null. So let's see here. Head head PTI is equal to time, which means it would be store minus one. Head PTI is equal to head PTI, free head PTI. Okay, free head PTI is zero. So I'm now taking the 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 free node. I'm taking out the free node and I'm putting into the linked list. So right now the first free node is uh, is a zero index. Free head pointer is equal to head pointer. Now it's it's zero. Free head pointer is the pointers free head pointer. Okay, what I'm doing he doing here is after putting pointers free head pointer, free head pointer is zero. Um yeah. So free head pointer is zero. Putting zero, I got the content one. I got the value one. So I'm updating the free head pointer. So now it's com it's initialized to one. Link list link data head pointer which is zero is equals to data. Now I'm adding the data, putting the data. Okay and the previous uh, value minus one pointers head ptr head ptr is zero is minus one you can see here that i am actually updating it so link link data head ptr 27 pointers head ptr minus one uh, the previous one okay minus one this is, so this is how i've created it now let's suppose if i wanted to add another one I'm adding another one, another data. So if I wanted to, let's say I'm putting 19. I've decided to put 19. Okay. Head pointer is the time. Right now it's zero now. It would be zero. Head pointer, free head pointer. The free head pointer was, is one. So one will come here. So head point, new head pointer would be one okay so free head pointer would be one so this is this would be the head pointer this would be one okay free head pointer is pointer okay this would be initialized to two link data free head point of one now the index one is 19 putting this and uh, pointers head pointer right now it, it was zero so zero okay so this is pointing to this node now so this is how it's it's going like this okay i'm adding another one let's say 17 and this would be index 2 and this will be pointing to 1 this would be pointing to 0 so it's going like this and this would be the head pointer then and then after that this would be the head pointer so it's going like this okay it's going like this 19 17 you know 27, 19, 36, 42, 16, 16 would be the head pointer. Um, 0, 1, 2, 3, 4. It, this would be the index 4. So, you know, you can see here. 4, 3, 2, 1, 0. Okay. So this is how you're inserting the data. Finding the data is, it's very easy. You just put a loop in here. So, I've created a boolean 
just to find out that if I got the data flag is equal to true yes hooray I got the value in tem is equal to head pts so always start with your head always start with the head you know you just take the content of the head pts where it's starting it head pts is used for starting there should be a start point where there's a link there's a chain you know there's always a start point so you just get the start point and then while time is not equal to minus one and flag is equal to fall this temp will keep on incrementing itself if link list data time is item search found else this is how I'm updating it okay time is got a pointer time so how it's happening time for example um, this is temp temp is equal to pointers temp pointers temp so you're putting four in the pointers link in the pointing in the pointers array um, four okay yes then you get this content you get three uh, pointers three you get two pointers two one you get one pointers one you get zero like this so uh, the find data part is very easy it's, this one is very easy the only uh, problem was that to understand the insert part since you, are, you guys haven't understood it so it this one will, would be very easy for you guys okay so this was easy this is you keep on incre incrementing itself until you get the values you get either uh, until uh, flag is equal to true you get what you want what you want it or time is equals to, uh, time is equals to minus one which means there is no data and also flag is equals to four as well okay so this is how it's going like that and if flag, uh, flag is equals to fall sorry item not found so I have just implemented this in the code so I have just decided decide to find uh, find it at 275 find it at 36 and if you can just see here sorry item not found item found in at 2 this is for 20 um, this one is for 20 uh, 36 this is for 2036 found in index 2012 36 is right here okay now delete now you want to delete something okay this one is very easy in order to delete something uh, let's see here now for example I wanted to delete 36 this is the value I, this is the node I want to delete completely this is my head PTR this is my free, free head PTR I want to delete this so I'm going to take old temp and I'm going to take temp1 uh, and what I'm going to do I'm going to take this old temp and I'm going to change the pointer of this one and I'm going to point to this one ignoring this completely so if I you know this whole chain one is connected to the other node you know you're having a rope between these two nodes this is how they are connected to one another like a rain track okay the rain the the train sorry the train are connected to one another you know railways so like that so you are pointing to this one now and this is completely ignored so this will be complete this will be added to the free head pointer link list Okay, so, so this would be the start of the free head pointer. So, so now this would point to 5, point, then this will point to 6, this will point to 7, this will point to 8, like that. Okay, so old time is now pointing to this one. So 3, 1, 0. Uh, the head pointer was here, 4, 3, 1, 0. Completely ignored. How uh, it's working, let's see how. So if head pointer is equal to minus one, which means linked list is completely empty, nothing here to delete. Else, you again take the head pointer. It's the same technique which I have, I'm just implementing over and over again. It's a completely same technique. Uh, let me see the input insert part. I didn't put that, but I have put in find it only. Find it and delete have the same technique. While time is not equal to minus one, flag is equal to false. If link data uh, this, if it is like this, then if it is thirty six, then temp one pointers. This is uh, the next pointer. Okay, as I'm taking the next pointer, pointers I've put here, and then I, and then I get the next pointer. Temp one is uh, this is the next pointer. Pointers time is equal to free head pointers. Okay, pointers head, which means that. If this is the node I'm looking for, this is 36. Pointers temp, which means I'm taking one 
and I'm initializing and I'm putting okay and I'm saying that it, this node should point to the fiat pointer which was this this was a fiat pointer so I'm just put I'm I'm pointing to this one this node okay initially fiat pointer was 5 this is 5 so now it's pointing to this uh, initially I, I got the next pointer and then I, I'm point I'm pointing I'm changing the pointer to point to this fiat pointer fiat pointer is equals to temp now the value is changed. The fiat pointer is now pointing to this one. The value of temp was two. Pointers old temp. Old temp. Where is the old temp? Old temp is zero for now. Old temp is zero. Okay. Initially, uh, while temp is not equal to minus one, flag is equal to fall if it is like you know you, right now it's starting from it's starting from here okay it's starting from here if it is if it is the item that we're looking for okay fine then it will work otherwise if else old time is equals to time the previous pointer and then this pointer has been incrementing pointing to the next one so this, this is how I got the old time okay so old time which was uh, which is this one old time is now point uh, um, pointers old temp temp one so right now the old time is one this one and temp one it means we are changing the pointer of this one so temp one which means this point temp one one okay this is how I'm this is how it's working and flag is equal to true okay if flag is false item was not found to be deleted so this is how you delete a node in this linked list with array and this is how I implemented it I got I've created this. I got the add pointer, fiat pointer. I put the find uh, the find data part 275. No, the item is not found. 36. Yes, item found is index two. Item deleted. So after deleting the item, I got the the new part. So you can see here that this one is completely updated. It's now pointing to uh, 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. This one. It's pointing to this one okay and this one is pointing to this one and this one is pointing to this one and minus one height pointer is four zero one two three four same thing and high free head pointer is two zero one two this is our free head pointer starting from here and thank you so much for watching this is how we are doing with linked list with array thank you so much for watching and i will see you guys in the next video and in the next video i'm going to discuss about binary tree with 